Hey guys, I'm over here at the Flux and Antimatter booth, and they've got some really cool new stuff. I'm a big fan of the Flux Raider. I've got some videos coming out on that soon. I don't know if I've put too many out yet, but check this out. So this is a P365 that they've got a brace attached to it that you can pretty easily conceal with an appendix holster. So I've never seen anything quite like this up to this point. It's a neat product. Um, I don't have a P365, but uh, I might have to get one. And then also, because Flux and Animatter are connected, Animatter is the company that makes the scope switch, right? So a lot of you are familiar with that. However, they recently released, I say released, they are, they are bringing to market a electronic version that allows you to zoom in and out simply by pressing these plus or minus buttons so you don't now have all this rail space occupied like you did before and it is a serious improvement so with the old scope switch i have to say i uh i wasn't a huge fan i found that the ergonomics were a little bit odd you had to kind of run it back with two fingers like this and then readjust your hand position to really have a good grip when you zoomed in Whereas with this guy, you can just zoom in and out with your C-clamp position, and it's pretty fantastic. Um, it does not feel significantly heavier. I don't know what the, the difference is in terms of weight, but you do not have all this aluminum out front here, so it's a little bit more balanced. You've got it here with a PLXC. You can still run the pro lever, and it the electronics will just pick up right where you left off. So if you go to three power and then finish off with the motor, it doesn't take any time to catch up to where you were or anything like that. Very impressive engineering, beautiful designing. I'm a bit of a fan and uh, I wasn't particularly, I was certainly skeptical beforehand. Obviously I've never shot a round through this gun with this on it, but I'm curious to see where they take it. Thanks guys.